Hello and welcome back to Cosex 3. We will... Uh, first of all, I'm playing on speed 3 now because the other speeds were just too slow. Like, we would have sit here for the next couple of hours. And with couple of hours, I mean the next couple of days if I wouldn't upgrade the speed. So, what is my plan for the future? Well, my plan for the future is simple. I'm going to just... This map is not really about skill, but about grinding. And as such, I'm going to just, you know, build up my economy, build as many troops as I can to stop the enemy from crossing. I'll also get a bunch of mercenaries because they are somewhat necessary, otherwise they will just rush over because I don't have the forces at the moment ready to hold this position without the mercenaries. And we're gonna also send some of our, our peasants over here to repair this mine. And we can still not use these two mines, sadly. Okay, the enemies are coming. But we have cannons in position to hopefully take them on. They should just open fire. Now that's more like it. Just kill them before they reach us. That shouldn't be too much of a problem. Or maybe it is, actually. Fire on the infantry. No, no, these riders shouldn't be a problem. Send our own riders over on the flank to take out his cannons. Oh, he's conquering my cannons now. By a goddamn drama, are you kidding me? Let's get them over here to hopefully take on his cannons. Yo, don't tell me we are actually losing because of here. Start fighting against them. Apparently my cavalry is a lot worse than his. Okay. Let's build a tower. But he took all of my cannons. And it, my cavalry just got destroyed by his. <coughs> so why don't we go ahead and build some sick Kozaken. Because we need some fast riders right here. And also, apparently... Oh. Okay. Well, let's get the Croats then. These guys apparently no are not the way to go. The Dragoons. Yeah, I think we lost again. <sighs> Frustrating. But there's nothing I can do. I don't... What am I supposed to do against two players alone? Like, I'm not sure. I'm not that good apparently in this game. And you would think that maybe muskets are their weakness? But apparently not. Apparently muskets are pretty, you know, useless against them. Uh, I hate this. Well, when is the last autosave? Oh, it was right before I made my normal autosave. Oh, but there are other autosaves, like this one. This one is a couple of days earlier. I don't really want to do this whole map again. Honestly, like I did it twice now. It's it's very hard apparently. Maybe I should turn down the turn down the difficulty because apparently I'm not as good as I thought. Damn. That's a that's a punch against my confidence. But this mission is very tough as well, like, there are two enemies against one, that's pretty... I mean, I can't really... I, I, I'm doing something wrong, apparently. That's for sure. Well, at least we have a good amount of forces now. Still, in this one. <clears throat> Even though I don't understand why my cannons do not fire automatically. Like, that's really annoying. I should probably position them up front here. And block him on the bridge. But the problem is he has these cannons that are firing on me. And for some reason they have a higher range than mine. And I can't really upgrade the range, I think. I also didn't speak to the monks yet. 
There's another gold mine here? I did not know about that. I just saw it. That's good to know. Let's get a couple of uh, peasants. Oh, let's get 15. Okay, that's bad. Who's shooting? Probably one of these cannons. Yeah. That is quite the problem. Because there's nothing I can do against that cannon. The problem really is it's just two shock points. And this is a... Uh, a choke point is hard to take as is, but he's actually defending it by just, you know, with two players, which makes it a lot harder. Obviously. Uh, do we have an officer over here? We do not. Let's get a couple then. Maybe I need to upgrade my musketeers. That's probably a good choice as well. I thought I did that already, however. <coughs> oh well, that was a good shot. How's it going with, uh, also the music stop for some reason. How's it going with my, oh, no, yeah. With my research. But we do have this m down here and this one. Probably should upgrade this one, this mine, so we get more gold. Gold seems to be the most important thing we lack. So, it's gonna be nice to get more of that. Uh, I don't really want to get rid of my mortars. They can just fire on this tower for now and destroy it, hopefully. Oh, okay. Send more people into that mine. We also need to get, like, a lot more peasants. Give me, like, 200 more peasants. Just in case. I don't know what he's firing at with this cannon at the moment. What could we fire at? Can we fire at the... No. The problem is we really need to stop him before he can, like, move over the bridge. Which is a lot easier said than done. <coughs> oh, we do have a diplomatic center over here. Though I don't think we have the gold necessary at the moment. To, you know, recruit a lot of mercenaries. What do we need mostly? Food and gold. Food shouldn't be too much of a problem. We can just send a bunch of peasants onto the fields. How's the research going? I'm gonna get a couple of multi barrel turrets. Maybe they. Not turrets, but barrel cannons. Maybe they will do good for us. We, we know how destructive they can be, and hopefully they attack on their own. Which would be nice. For a change, at least. I'm gonna get like. Four of them. Over here. They're gonna take a long time, but they're gonna be worth it, hopefully. Let's send more people into this mine. I think we can still get one more. Oh no, I think we got all. Yeah. Okay. What else can we research? Repair all artillery, heal all units. Let's heal all our units for now. Seems like a good choice. I wish we could build boats. Like, set a fair over here and maybe take out this uh, fortress so we can flank around. That would be really nice. What are you firing at? Firing at this formation over here. I, you know, I'm fine with that. Continue doing so. multi barrel turrets. Ah, oh, finally. I don't know why I keep saying turrets to them. But the multi barrel cannons are being built or have been finished. So let's position them over here and just crush anything that comes over the bridge. 
while we uh, continue building up our force. We also need a bunch more houses. Let's hope that is enough. And I will send a lot more people to stone cut and get wood. Uh, yes, let's upgrade our harvest. Because that seems important for the future. You can form a formation as well, so that's good. Yes, harvesting is now better. That's good. Uh, durability of buildings, durability of walls and towers. And excavation speed, yes. <coughs> excavation speed is also nice. We are getting a lot of gold now, which is very good. And soon... Uh, let's send them over to cut some wood already. Get another one. So we have 30 now. <coughs> and why don't we upgrade the durability of our... Of all buildings. Yeah, good. We need a tower over here on our own. So let's get this tower going right there. Even though I think towers are kind of useless, I haven't really seen them doing much yet. Let's get two multi multi-barreled cannons over there. They're very slow as well. The houses are being built. Or they were being built, but now they stopped for some reason. We need to upgrade our mines even further. Wood and gold. That wood as a problem is somewhat bad. Another nine can be sent over here. Where are the other seven? Over here somewhere? Go and build. I'm gonna send one of you to woodcut. Actually, I can just... Send one of you. Uh, okay, m apparently we have too many woodcutters now. Over on this side, maybe we can find... Yeah, we have a lot of forests over there, so that's not a problem. I want around a hundred of both at this point, just to spam out the resources. <coughs> really want to upgrade these mines to the, to the last level. Or I don't know if that's even the last level, but I really want to upgrade them anyway to get more gold. Gold seems to be the most important resource, which seems somewhat obvious. And actually, food is pretty important as well. Um, I think I need to get more grain personally. Uh, I could upgrade my harvest, but I would actually like to upgrade my, you know, the growing because. They are, they are harvesting good, but they're not growing as much. Also, I don't want to spend the gold yet. I want to spend it on these, uh, on this mine. Which will happen anytime soon. Right now. Okay, good. Maybe we can trade some... No, not really. Don't really have any coal or iron... Over. I'm a bit mad that you are not building these uh, houses, but well, that's okay. I'm just gonna order it personally then, and send a lot of people into this mine. With the upgrade of this mine, we can upgrade the other gold mines as well, which is really good. This one is actually already upgraded, but this one needs to be upgraded soon. So we just need gold for that. Which is very good. Easily acquired. How's it going over here? Oh! Cannons are enough. What the hell happened over here? What happened over here? Apparently he attacked or something. He's destroying this tower now. That's quite bad.
Well, I need a new line of troops here. <clears throat> Alright, let's stop the construction of a no new riders. Let's upgrade our musketeers further. Okay, how's it going? So, uh, where are you going? Like, what, what? Why are you so aggressive? Get some riders uh, over here to take on this, these cannons. You really shouldn't be so aggressive. Okay, the multiple tails are apparently very good uh, against them. Like they are taking out these guys without any problems. Let's, let's just kill them all. You've lost a mine? What? Oh, this mine. Okay, yeah, that's acceptable. Where is he firing from? Oh, all the way over there. I think it's time for us to attack. Like, this is the perfect opportunity. This is the perfect opportunity for us to attack. So let's get all of our forces. I think you can... Oh, good save. Get all of our men and attack over here. Let's go, boys. It's time to prove your worth to the king and queen. Uh, that is not what I went to do. Get back on the fields. Get get back over here. Okay, well that's that's not good. I didn't mean to just put all of my peasants over there. Get back on these stone mines, you lazy peasants. Uh, it's going okayish over here. I have no idea actually what's happening. They are killing a lot of over these guys over there. Not sure what the, if the cannons have reached yet. I think we lost one of our multi barrel cannons. They are very important for this fight. I just want everyone to attack move into here. Like if you can get through, just kill the blue player. But I also need more troops. Like get get crowds now. And also recruit some grenadiers. Because we need reinforcements should this not work. But it seems very good right now. So maybe we can actually push through now. There are more peasants coming from over here. Go back to work. Uh, go back to work. We have lost a lot of our riders. <coughs> and apparently the attack move is no longer valid. <coughs> Come on. Don't get pushed back now. Come on, multi barrel cannons. Yo, I count on you. We've nearly done it. I should have left some cavalry forces for now because that would have been good, but. I mean, let's get some of these crowds to take on these cannons. No, 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 go over here. Yeah, attack, move, right there. Kill the few remaining uh, troops that attack you. And then go and, like, attack everything over here. Maybe get some of these peasants on my side, that would be nice. Fire on something? I'm not sure what to do right now. 
I, I didn't expect to make it this far. Uh, why don't we go ahead and recruit some sick Cossacks? Because they are a fast, very fast unit. Exactly what we need right now. Uh, I think I, we did it. I think we did it. Oh, but they are... Oh, no. No, no. There are a lot more coming now. Can we take over this town hall? We did. Okay, well, that's an interesting noise. Well, let's destroy it. We're now getting a lot of Kazakhen and Croats. I don't think we've taken over this uh, stuff. Let's send our crowds over here again. Like we've we've done a little bit of damage, but we need a new multi barrel cannon and cannons again. <coughs> and these sick Kozakna are hopefully going to I'm going to attack this fort over here with them. Oh I sent all of my mortars against them as well, huh? That's quite bad. Yeah, right now I just want to take over these cannons and destroy them. Uh, can we get down he here? There. I don't know where the other cannons are. But we could probably push through here. And maybe take over some of his peasants down here and his town hall. He doesn't really have any units over here. So that's good. Just to harass him now. Now that we've breaking, uh, broken through. At least a little bit. He must have some units around. Oh, yes. He also has a cannon tower over here. Okay, he's no defending the side down here. Apparently, my crowds are not as good as his cavalry. But we have a lot of these sick Kazakhs now. Uh, we They can't get through, though. Which is a problem. Not get some peasants to work on the on the tower, and the rest will go woodcut because we have a shortage of woodcutters at the moment. Let's also upgrade our gold mine over here. We have a good surplus of gold right now, so that's really nice. We we finally done something. We've even pushed through. I don't really want to push with my Kazak my Kazakhs just yet, but I think they could do it. Like, I don't think they are going to be stopped by this small force right here. And they're so quickly recruited as well. Of course, we can only build one diplomatic center, but still, they, they're going to help us destroy these men. If they don't get killed by the cannons, that is. Oh no, not a single one died. <clears throat> so let's see how good they do. Okay, a lot of them are dying, but... Oh, I think they just got crushed. And yeah, they just got destroyed. Lo <laughs> well... Maybe not as good as I hoped. What else can we get? Could get some Dragooners. Some Light Cavalry, what's the... Oh, requires gold for upkeep, spends a lot of coal and firing. Oh, they, he did, he can fire. Effective against any other kind of mercenaries. The Dragoon. Effective against... Mm, effective for diversionary raids. Yeah, well, raids is not really what I need right now. Capable of destroying enemy buildings and fortifications with grenades. Effective at setting ships aflame. Light infantry. Low and defense values. Mm, not really good. Around here now. I guess I'm gonna go with the the grenadiers then, because they seem to be the best. Then, crowds, fast building time, high movement, ineffective against infantry in combat formations or heavy cavalry. Okay. Okay, he's destroying my tower now again. Let's hope he can't just push against us now. Can't apparently form 
any kind of formation, which is bad. <clears throat> well, let's hope our cannons are stopping them. He has a lot of cannons this himself now, and apparently we didn't do any damage, like... We destroyed a town hall, but who knows how much damage that actually has done to him. I doubt that it's much. Uh, no, no, get me like a, another hundred peasants for now. For our mines as well. Lost our tower, of course. Not much I can do against that. You have not enough peasants inside you? Okay, change it. Crowds or sick Kazakhan, get over, over here and help them. And your crowds will attack them from the side now. Let's hope we can crush them before they uh, set up camp or something. They, I don't think they have a formation, so it should be going good for us. We're also firing on them from the back, so that's pretty nice. It looks like we will win this battle. Though we have lost quite some forces. Yes, the cannons are so good. Get back in formation. I want a couple of Hobbitses. Howitzer. Give me five of them. Pretty nice. Uh, they're very strong cannons. Effective against fortification and massed infantry. Low rate of fire and accuracy. When out of gold, they stop firing. Unguarded howitzers can be captured. Spends a lot of coal on firing. Yeah, I noticed. I noticed that. Maybe we should upgrade our iron mine next. Maybe a coal mine as well. Very good. I have a lot of gold right now. That's very nice. And we are spending a lot of it still on grenadiers. Because the rest of our forces are just uh, so slowly recruited. Uh, where do we have an officer? Let's uh, get a grenadier's formation. You can't form a formation, that's fine. Well, as long as we, he doesn't fire at my production uh, buildings, then I'm okay with that. Uh, did we destroy the town? We did. I still need to take out the gate, however. So let's get a couple of normal cannons as well. And we should further upgrade our musketeers and all that stuff. Uh, we have a couple of mines that need peasants now as well. So let's get them in there. Oh, it's a huge grind, this map. Hopefully other maps are a little bit less grindy. Uh, what do we have here? Rate of fire, yes, please. Rate of fire is super important. Okay, there's another force of him coming. So if we can just... Oh, the cannons! The cannons are so good. Let's actually get the crows back because they're not really needed. Actually, I think we need to attack with everything. Because otherwise he's just going to set up camp and bombard us with his cannons and that's not gonna be good for us. As you can see, we are taking heavy losses already. So let's hope we can take out his... Oh, he's destroying my mine! Oh, the bastard! Yeah, we cannot let him cross the bridge. That's not good. I think we're... Yeah, we're definitely going to push him back again. Not sure if we are strong enough to push him all the way back. But we can certainly try. He destroyed my diplomacy center! Damn it! That is really bad. I needed that. I just wanted to get a lot of Cossacks for a raid. Let's get our cannons back. I don't want to rush them into there. All the cannons we conquered as well. Just get them all, of, all out of here. <coughs> We should be able to rush uh, through here. Get our cavalry as well to conquer this cannon quickly. 
and hopefully we can build this diplomacy center really quick and then upgrade this mine again how are you doing I'm not recruiting quick enough that's the worst of it that they are so slow at recruiting normal units okay there are a bunch of other forces coming oh there's too much too much cavalry there for my riders to take care of but we did break through here again oh can we take out these cannons real quick they destroyed them I'm not sure if the Spucks are heavy infantry, but he just destroyed my formation here. It's very bad. <clears throat> the, he, uh, do you see that? He already has so many troops out again. I'm not even sure how he does it. He just spams them so quickly. Okay, the diplomacy center is back up again. I immediately need my grenadiers back. And let's get a mine over here as well. Destroy these cannons so that the enemies don't get them. Form up a small... Actually, let's get the bombards over here and just let them fire on the enemy gate. The pro Another problem is that I can't build walls, which is pretty bad. I mean, if I could funnel him through, like, right here, or if I actually had the range that he has, apparently, then that wouldn't all be a problem. What do we get over here? Armored f soldier defense, no. I would like my artillery to have more range, but that's really expensive. I need like a second artillery, uh, not artillery, recruitment. No, not a recruitment. <laughs> what am I trying to say? A second diplomacy center. Let's get the peasants down here. And I'm gonna try to... Oh, I'm gonna build a couple of... 7th century... I had a mortar over there. That's pretty bad, because now he's going to bombard us again. Let's try to destroy that. Bombards, can you just fire at them? You, you really have that kind of terrible range? Oh, he's going to destroy this for sure again. Not much I can do. Yeah, that the cannons don't fire on their own is also quite a bad thing. But, damn. So many cannons. Okay, well. So many mortars. Let's quickly take them over so that he can no longer harass me with them just gonna destroy them because I don't want them there's quite a lot of men here bombard the gate the main problem is that he's constantly destroying my goddamn mine over here but I need that mine. Can't build it yet. Let's build the 18th century barracks here. Let's hope he doesn't destroy them because they're actually very expensive. I also want a second of that soonish when I can afford it. And that may be never because they are really expensive. He's already firing at me with mortars again. Okay, the main problem is that he's actually in range of these buildings. Not sure what he's firing right now. What is he firing at right now? Oh, it's me. I'm firing at him. It's not him firing at me. I think. Well, can we get some more durability for our buildings? Walls and towers. No, that's not really what I want. How expensive is the second one? 25,000 gold. That's quite a lot. But it's still affordable. Okay, so you're treating now. 
Yeah, we are attacking the enemy, I know. How evil of us. Um, get these cannons over there. Because they are a lot more effective. Or, a lot more. They are a lot of... No, they, that's right. They are a lot more effective against gates for some reason. Because uh, mortars are supposed to fire over the gate. But then again, they can't really fire at infantry, which is somewhat weird. Get your priorities straight, mortar. <coughs> Mortars are the most annoying <laughs> of all enemy sh cannons, or of all cannons in the game, as they have an insane range. Okay, what can we get? Like, we could get some more range for artillery, that's pretty good. More firepower, uh, accuracy, that seems very important. Of course I would like some uh, battleship production. I would also love to, like, upgrade the production speed of everything. Oh, race builder's salary. That seems pretty good. Let's get that, because they are building this thing forever. This is going to speed it up so much. Let's raise their salary. I have no problem with that. Yeah, you see that? He's firing at me already, but my cannons are not firing at him. Because they need the order to actually open fire. Which is somewhat weird. You two need to attack that gate. Very accurate of you. They have a lot of health! Get our riders over here again to take on his cannons. But also upgrade. No, no, no. Yes, you are supposed to take out his cannons. You're just gonna take them over at this point. I don't really care about destroying them anymore. Get them down here. <laughs> Put them to the other cannons we took over. Uh, let's repair our cannons real quick Because our multi-barrel cannons are actually hurt, which is bad. I need them. Okay, we've uh, finished this building What is this, the difference between a 18th century and a 17th century man except that they probably take longer to recruit? Oh No, no they actually take a lot less to recruit Oh, okay, well that's uh, a pretty important thing to know. So let's start getting... Uh, do we want musketeers or... I think I'm gonna take musketeers because they are a lot cheaper. But yeah, they are a lot, a lot quicker to be uh, recruited. Cannons, open fire. Yeah, you see that he's already firing at me again and my cannons are not firing at him. That's super annoying. They're just destroying my formation over here. Oh, you apparently fire on them. Even though you're supposed to fire on that gate. <clears throat> well, I'm not sure if there's a maximum of cannons he can recruit, so I'm just gonna keep on conquering them. And we're gonna wait until we can build another one of those 18th century barracks, but for now I'm gonna end the episode here. I thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed then consider leaving a like and a comment down below And I'm pretty frustrated with this mission so far all things considered. I Mean we made some some progress, but I couldn't use it sadly because uh, he just spams out his troops so quickly Anyway, we will see us in the next episode until then take care. Bye